Hi, Mum. How are you? Good, thank you. <clears throat> I'm doing good. What are you doing? Where did you go, fucking hell? Yesterday you didn't call at all? Yeah. Huh? I was sleeping. You slept 24 hours? No, I slept, I slept 8 hours. I do bro, Ali. You didn't call. I know. I was doing some work. Yeah, the time is good, Mama. It's it's not raining, and it was not that sunny today. But it's just like it's cool. Like it's like twenty degrees. Yeah, I got my police right. check. I got my police check, and I got the bank card. I got the travel card. What did that say for your police check? They said no criminal charges. Oh, for super, yeah. they, they said that time when you paid the fine. All, all they said was no court cases discharged or something like that. But oh, that's why it doesn't matter that you paid a fine, but you weren't charged. Yeah, Gosh. yeah, yeah. When you go to court, it's a different story. They they write down it. Gosh, but yeah. you got That means like everybody would have a criminal record in Australia. Like everybody gets some parking fine or yeah. red light, yeah. you know. And yeah. Well, these sort of things, and that when you hit that girl, you weren't charged in court. Gosh, yeah. that's why. I didn't mean to hear that. Are you happy about that? Huh? You were a bit nervous about that check, weren't you? No, I wasn't. I wasn't because you you said that, that, what's it called? That if I was convicted over there in the courts, that they would have told me. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I knew you wouldn't if that was just the thing, you know, because you weren't in court for that. You were just charged. The yeah. police, you know, it's not a something like, you know, uh, stealing from a shop and then being, being charged or, yeah. you know, yeah. assault and being charged in court. That's why. He yeah. paid the fine, he got to go. Yeah. And how about the card? What did they say to you? <coughs> and they said it's $3.50. Australian yeah. dollars to withdraw. In Europe. In Europe. Okay, it's so, not that bad. So there's eight currencies, there's no dinar, there's no market, there's no corner. I have to withdraw in Euros. It doesn't matter, like you can in Slovenia, you can in Germany, you, you don't need it's even better that you can't withdraw over there, so you get better <coughs> to lose, you waste your money. Such. Yeah. When you go over there it's not expensive. It's good that you got that card. You know? Yeah. And when is it going to come? I already have it. Oh, get... Did you get it straight away? Yeah, they give it to you straight away. Oh, wow. Oh, they said the original, <laughs> that mum, they said the original MasterCard without yeah. the travel card, is around $25 per transaction. See, I told you. Yeah. A lot of people get charged. So from Croatia, from the 1st of the 1st, 2023, they're going to have euros. It's not going to be cool no more. Yeah, Croatia. But Croatia is in the Euro European Union. Croatia is. But they didn't get the dozvola yosh to use the euro. They will from the 1st of January next year. Ah. But it's not good, you know. Why? Because they're going to have inflation and if someone had three at the corner, like, you know, you can survive somewhere. But what are they going to have? They're going to have the clay, maybe 200 euros. Let's see. It's going to be like less when it's in euros and yeah. people are going to suffer. Yeah, It'll yeah. be better than if they kept their corner, you know. Yeah. So, that's a sh- uh. But Croatia is in the European Union, and uh, from next year there won't be any borders, Slovenia and Croatia no more. Yeah. Only oh. Croatia, Bosnia, Herzegovina, Croatia, Serbia, <coughs> Croatia, uh, I don't know which other countries are not in the European Union. Yeah, yeah. Croatia, Tsarnagora. Tsarnagora. Tsarnagora is not in the European Union, but they got, they have Euros there. Oh, wow. Uh, but they had euros there when not even Croatia was in the European Union. They bought out the euros and they 
They've had euros for 20 years now. So why does the Croatia buy out the euros? Croatia doesn't. They don't want the people don't want that because oh. I'm telling you, everything will be more expensive. Yeah. But they're gonna want. They, they're gonna have to because the parliament wants. But it's gonna make a lot of poverty. Even here, when I was here, it was Deutsche Mark. Yeah. And then yeah. after everything that was one <coughs> Deutsche Mark was <coughs> was uh, one euro in the end, and the Deutsche Mark was equivalent to fifty cents to a euro. Ah. So. 10 marks was 5 euros. So imagine if something was 1 mark or 5 euros, it was 5, if, if it was 5 marks for yeah. some salami. When the euro came, it was 5 euros. Yeah. And that would be 10 marks, not 5. <laughs> <laughs> Everything went double. Yeah. So it doesn't matter, like you're going to have money in your pocket, you don't need your card anyway to take out. So, so how much shall I withdraw for Mostar have for Serbia and Croatia? You, you'll be here when you withdraw, you don't need to withdraw now. Uh, yeah, but they said that it, it withdraws in their current currency. That's That woman said that if I go to that country and I try to withdraw from their ATM, that it will withdraw in their currency. Of course, it's going to withdraw in their currency. You're not going to get Australian dollars. Yeah. <laughs> but it's normal. No? But it's just weird because yeah. they said on the internet that there's only 13 currencies that transact. So I'm but sure. maybe America, Europe, and yeah. sing, maybe Singapore or something else. That's a tabby transaction. The Kapoja, she's not the same pace to dollar, and they must Yeah. 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 The rest leave in your bank account. <clears throat> yeah, and I'll give you one. I'll, I'll, I'll give you. Take out a thousand. Doesn't matter. <coughs> yeah. yeah, I'll give you, Mama. I'll give you one of my travel cards because I have two of them. So in case I lose one, right. I'll have the other one. Yeah, How come you got two? But they give you two just in case you lose one. Ah, okay. He was with Sabi Hilia do Dollar, Ili Hilia do Ipo, and leave it in your pocket when you leave Australia. Yeah, yeah. Okay? Yeah. In the Kimash North, say. In the meantime, that you're going to have enough money, that's enough money to survive for a, 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 a time. Okay? Yeah. You don't need the what you have. Okay? Yeah, I have $2,500 now. Adopt. Yeah. And I have three more payments. Yeah. And you might just score a 3000 when you leave, yeah? More, more. I have $4,000. All together. Okay, God damn it. Uh, all together with the three payments. Hang on, wait. That was something. Uh... Did you get your payment now, or you're getting it tomorrow? I got it today. Oh. Oh. And then you get one before you leave. Yeah. And you got two and a half now, yeah. What? And how much money do you have now? Two and a half. Yeah, just around two and a half. There you go. You'll have three thousand. Yeah. And take out, can pour just one and a half thousand, the rest leave your account to go to, okay? Where? Take it out, where? Take it out to Australia, fucking dog. What, in euros? In dollars. Why? I can do just show them, and then we can wait when the dollar is good, you can go and change it. <coughs> no, 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 I have the travel card, Bama. Yeah, but you need money in your pocket, Danny. I can use my travel card. Yeah, but your travel card, each transaction, $3.50. That's all right. Yeah, but Zashtanizot is saving $1,000 and you don't have to take out 
money for a while. But, but then it's gonna cost. It's gonna cost over there at the at the exchange rate. It's gonna cost like twelve dollars to change. No, it won't because you'll be getting it, the euros out of the. You won't be giving you dollars. You'll be getting us. You'll be getting it in euros. Yeah, but the, it's it's a exchange rate is costing already twelve dollars to exchange it into euros. You get it. Yeah, Daddy Ali, the Australian dollar is very weak now. Yeah, it's very weak. So what I checked, six hundred euros is nine hundred dollars. Yeah, I'm telling you, it's very weak now. Yeah. That's why I said take out at least a thousand, have it in your pocket, and we follow the dollar when it's good. We fucking change. Yeah. I do what you want, Daddy. Shut up, the Mum, mum, it's better. It's better that I come over there. And we draw some money from the account over there in euros. It's going to be three dollars fifty, and that's it. Yeah. But you need some money in your pocket. You can't travel overseas with no money in your pocket. Then. Yeah. You're going to go to Singapore. You might want a drink. You might want to get something. Yeah. You need money. Yeah, I will draw. I will draw a hundred dollars. One hundred dollars is enough. Right. <coughs> So what's Toba doing? He's sleeping in the lounge room. Ah. I, I had to go and buy new tires for my car. Well, it was a time to, to change tires, huh? Daddy, with the tires I have, some are down here. It uh, costs more, maybe a half a litre and a half to kilometres more petrol. Ah. Why? Because, um, because... The winter gumbe. Yeah, it's must have winter gumbe from October to April. You have to have it. Uh -huh. Otherwise, you get bad. I mean, you don't have to, but if you have a car accident and it's not your fault, by law, it's your fault because you didn't have winter. Uh. Uh, right. And I didn't have any summer ones. Yeah. They went a few years ago and then I wasn't even driving the car that much, just here to the shops and that. But because we're going to go down with you and that, we need this car. And I had, I went and changed it today. I gave you 600 euros. <coughs> how much? 600 euros? 500 and... Oh, let me see how much it was. Wow, that's expensive. Uh, yeah. 500... And 62 euros and one cent. Wow. And that's without the fail, yeah? What's that? I take my fail, get off from my winter, I, uh, winter wheels to put them on the summer wheels. Ah. Uh. If I got them with the fail, yeah? A thousand euros each. Wow. Yeah. So I bought the winter rice at home, and then like in October I have to change it back. Why is it then so much, Mama? Over here my dad changed tyres and it was $500. <coughs> have to pay these $500, yes, 500 euros. Uh, uh, yeah, but... And plus, plus my Akube, they're like, you know, um, Shiroki. It depends how Shiroki. Mine is 225. Shirida. Uh, oh, no, that's 17. I don't know what that is. Yeah. Hey, mum, do you need money? Go... No, no. I, I, I saved for this. I knew that I need this. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I needed them. And plus, you know, when we go down, well, maybe half a litre of petrol on 100 kilometres. And each of us, each, the time we run, we 3,000 and plus driving around another thousand, that's four thousand kilometers. Yeah. And if you go half a liter times ten, it's five about thirty, forty liters more petrol in winter. It's almost a tank more. Wow. Yeah. Well it goes slower, does it? No, it doesn't go slower, but it uh only so dobre u kish it's near. Yeah. Uh, when it's summer, they use up more petrol because only so strong, or not, or not. They 
they're very deep in the calves because uh-huh. of the rain and, uh, and uh, these were 120 euros each. Hey mum, hey, did you yeah. chuck your winter tyres or did you keep it? I fucking keep it, my daddy fucking. I just paid 600 in October last year. Yeah. Uh, I gave 1,200 euros for winter and for summer wheel. Yeah, you may as well keep it because then you just go change it and maybe just service for $100. I don't need service. I got a 25 euros. Look, Shiny, some of them be probably only cost me $40 in October. Ah. See? 40 euros. So it's going to cost you 40 euros only for the next 10 years then? Because you have tyres. Every year, Sandy. The company team, we're only allowed to drive 25,000 or 30,000. That's it. Uh huh. You have to change them. Uh-huh. The police fucking catch you and get that paper or that, that movie. So what they think is to see that your winter uh, source sees Liz, you get a fine, 5,000 euros here. Yeah, yeah. You can't have to drive those tyres how much you want. Uh, they have to be very deep cut, the, the, <coughs> the, the winter ones. Yeah, yeah. If they're not, I've got Swizzlies, do you get a fine. Yeah. And I already went. Tom or Barbara already, I put it with 8,000 kilometers already. Ah. Uh, Maybe another two winters, that's it. Uh-huh. Chuck them away. Yeah. Uh-huh. Maybe this year... Winter and next year winter, that's it. Right. It all depends how much you drive the car. Yeah. Because if you don't drive the car, you can have the full man for a lot of years. Yeah, right. yeah. Are you okay? Tom, uh, like he was driving there when we went back, he goes, the car feels very much lighter now. Of course, it's lighter. The uh-huh. They are lighter than their summer wheels. Yeah. I could have got, got, you can get also mix match, like mix gourmet, which are for winter and for summer. Yeah, yeah. Uh, how I about, could have done that, but but um, they're not good, those mix ones in, in winter. If you go somewhere in that, opets uh, a and sneak, they're not as strong as the real winter ones, uh, you know. Uh, how about the summer ones? Are they good in, win- are they good in the rain? Yeah, they could. Ali Morash Malopazik, Katya Kisha, and then they could Yeah, yeah. Ali Ohai. Pembera, Ali Ohai, Sanzas Ghetto, Kubo Stars, Nabi, Chetres Gradi, Moisi, the 35. It's too hot for winter gumbe over there. Yeah, yeah. And uh, many Visha Treba, winter gumbe, and Ego Summer gumbe. You know, the Visha Ima winter. Yeah. So we have to have the winter ones from October to April. And then you got May, June, July, August, September, five months of summer. Yeah. The rest is winter. Yeah. Uh, Why is it five months I of summer? Got, I could have got for six, seven hundred for winter end, and I don't have to change. But the ones for the mixed ones like uh, that are for summer and winter are not the same. Yeah. For winter. Hey, mum, why is it? Uh, why is it yeah. If, yeah. You feel more safe, safer with the real winter one. Uh-huh. Hey, mum, why why is it five months summer and seven months winter? So it's the way Germany is. Uh huh. It's colder here than what it's hotter. But it's changed. I remember when I first came to Germany, when I was coming back from Mostar in August, people was people were already in um, Yakne and, and boots. Yeah. It was cold. Yeah. But now August is very hot. <coughs> yeah. The climate has changed very <laughs> much. We had three tornadoes the other day in Germany. We never had a tornado. Again. No, not again, but uh, 200 kilometers from me, there was some winds and that, uh-huh. 150 an hour, if I could sushi everything, and one guy got hit by lightning. Wow. Uh, Did he die? Uh, the climate, it's changed, yeah. Wow. It's gory on that. Wow. 
when the lightning hits you, you go on fire. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <clears throat> That's why when there's lightning, stay away from trees. Uh huh. Because the lightning always strikes the trees and crawl away and all yeah, that. Yeah. I got two, three, I think, on the roof, putting Groma. They're yeah. like things that stick up on the roof. Uh huh. So that if it thunders on the roof, it doesn't caught, catch on fire. Ah. One house caught on fire two years ago here, not far from me. They didn't have that. Uh -huh. Everybody was fucking jumping off the fucking windows and everything. Wow. Well, then you grow up with the thing, and it didn't have a grown up, but I have that. Wow. And uh, everything just was <coughs> on fire, the second floor, whatever. Wow. Yeah. So, lightning is very, very opaque, you know? Yeah. So, Mum, did you go to Josie's and Susie's house? No, no. <laughs> Get it, guys. Yeah. Yesterday, I, I, uh, I went swimming today. Ah, how was it? Good. I, I did. I, I couldn't believe it. I said to Tom, I thought that the watch, the clock stopped. He goes, why? I go so fast. <laughs> and I didn't know why I was so fast, you know? Yeah. Like, because I haven't been going like lately because of coronavirus, <laughs> I couldn't get in because I was not vaccinated. And um, uh huh. And I'm thinking, why am I not so tired now? Like, <laughs> uh, because like it takes a few days for me to go to the pools to get back on track, you know, like I am all the time. Yeah. And I'm sitting here having my coffee, and I go, "Bitch, yeah, I know why. I can breathe through my nose." Ah. There you go. I think that's why I'm quicker. I didn't even realize that. I forgot. <laughs> yeah. Because when my nose was blocked, I was breathing only through my mouth, and it was really hard. I, but I used to like do fifty laps, like you know, in like forty-two minutes. Yeah. How about now? Well, I don't know. I did thirty laps. I didn't want to do it overboard from the beginning, you know, because if because my muscles. I'm not toned up yet properly, and if I force it, then I won't go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it's better doing 30 for a week, and then the next week, go for it, 50. Yeah, yeah. But tomorrow, I'll probably do 20, because after that, I've got aqua fitness in the water. Ah. I put, I don't put a <coughs> thing around my waist to hold you up for water. Yeah. And for me, everybody else does, I don't. And I put weights on my leg. Uh-huh. And uh, much, much harder to do it, but uh -huh. I, I can do it. You get weights, they're made from styropoil. Yeah, you know, yeah. And, um, mm. if you have to keep your legs down if, because the styropoil floats up. It doesn't yeah. And I've got nothing around my waist to keep me above water, so I have to work really hard with my legs to yeah. keep me up above water. Yeah. And mum... It goes for 45 minutes. Yeah. And when, when, I, when, they do. when I give you my Apple Watch, mum, you're going to have much more to see what, how long you you were swimming for, and you can also see how much kilometres you swam. <coughs> I, don't, I don't swim kilometres, then... The yeah, but you, you can you can see how much um, meters you you swam. And, uh, yeah. 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 I can be chamuze to get the team knowledge. I'll get the Fitbit. I'll get the Fitbit. What is that? It's it's for Samsung phones. And how much is that? It's like an Apple Watch, but just for Samsung phones. Uh, yeah. I each of us I know, get for how much it is yeah. and whatever. Yeah. My 
Bonjour Tima, ma bonjour vous êtes on on a on a fait travail to pay it off and I'll pay it off for you. I'll pay it. I'll pay for it. Hold on. Daddy, don't worry. Just a sec. We'll pop back a door just so you will see the prices. Okay. Yeah, but I'll, I'll pay for my Fitbit, Mama. You you can give me the clothes. <laughs> Okay. Yeah, we'll go together. We'll go together. I'll get the Fitbit for myself. Uh, you like the Samsung phone or what? Yeah, I'm not. I'm never getting myself an iPhone ever again. Really? Yeah, because every single every single year I have I have what I need. I told you, Mum, I have what I need in terms of technology now. So my phones, I can do my work. I can do my work, and that's it. I don't need iPhones, the newest iPhones, to do my work. <coughs> I don't need an iPhone to do my work. Yeah. Where's so, your dad? And dad's sleeping. But mum, I save. I save every single year. So imagine I got. I got myself a new iPhone every single year, for seventy-one years. That's around two hundred thousand dollars. I save. Danny, you're not gonna get an iPhone every year for seventy one years. Yeah, but I'm saying I'm saying just in case, like iPhones like if, didn't even exist until ten years ago, eleven. Yeah, but it, if I had the money if I had the money, for example, and I was an iPhone freak, I I would save two hundred thousand dollars over seventy one years. <clears throat> yeah. But I have I have technology, Mama. Like I have three phones. I use that to great effect now. I've been using two phones now. I have I have I have to upload another six hundred videos online to YouTube, and I have to upload my quotes online. Fifteen days, I think. Let me check. Sixteen days. Wow. <clears throat> Do you remember back in November, Mama, when I was calling you from the hospital? Yeah, November. He in July. Call, he was I, 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 was call, I was calling you in July. Yeah. And look how time gone quick. That's how time goes quickly, baby. By the time you know it, you'll be here soon. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> No stress. Yeah. Your smile. So uh, all you have to do now is do your teeth and that's it. Nothing else. No, I still have to do this. I'll tell you now. What? I have to get my teeth cleaned. I have to get the coronavirus test. Did you find out how much? Is it free or do you have to pay for it? It's for free. It's for free. Oh, <clears throat> it's drive through, and I have an APM appointment, which is my provider appointment. Yeah. I have Sendlink to go to 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 do something for the employment provider. I have Jurassic Park, which is on the ninth of June. I have the movies. Yeah. I have the letter to do with Doctor Enwa. You have to what? I have to do the letter, the medical thing, what so that I can take my medication on the plane. Aha, uh -huh. yeah, yeah. Yeah. Robert, I thought you should have on your appointment at the doctor. Yeah, I have an appointment with the doctor, an injection, and also I have to get you a bottle of whiskey. I thought at the airport then. Yeah, I still have to do that though. <clears throat> But mum, I don't think it's going to come in that package that you said. That's a matter. Then you can get something in Singapore. You ring me from Singapore and then we'll see what they have and you tell me the price. So if it doesn't okay. come in that, so if it doesn't come in that bottle, the way it looks, so you want me to get something in Singapore? Yeah. Okay. Vaji. Yeah. And you call me from Singapore. Yeah, I'll call you in Singapore. Are you going to be awake though? Well, I think so, Danny. Yeah. What if you're I'll not... see now. I'm trying to make something. Oh, I guess I have to light it up. 
také skoro by prste ísť gori, píčku, vlastne. I just want to say that I'll sing a poor time. Just want to say something. Yeah. Sing. Go, go see what the difference is. And I have to get you chocolates. I have to get you chocolates. Well, it's 23, 26 over there mm. now. Tuesday. So they're up front from us. Uh, one, two... Uh, 7, 20, uh, 5, 26, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. There's six hours up front from us. Ah. Uh -huh. And so that means, wait a minute, uh, six hours up front. So I don't know what time you're going to be in Singapore. Let me check. Hang on. Let me check. You'll be in Singapore... I'm in Singapore at 21.20. But which time 21.20? But 21.20 is always 11.20 in the afternoon, in the evening. 9.20 you mean? No, 21.20. 20. 9.20 in the... Yeah, 21.20 is 9.20. Yeah, yeah, in the evening. Yeah, Ali, are they counting that as Australian time or are they counting that as Singapore time? That's Singapore time. Papa, I'll be awake then. It'll be 3.26 in the afternoon here. Yeah, yeah. Dobro. Yeah, I'll be awake and you'll be in Singapore. Wait, wait, wait. wait, wait. Mum, they, they're counting that as Australian time, sorry. Because I leave at 15. <laughs> I, I leave at 15 and I, live, I, I arrive at there at 21.20. You get it? No, look, you leave Singapore at 23.55. And you come to Frankfurt at 6.45. Oh, I fucking get confused. That's their time. It doesn't matter, Daddy. Whatever time it is, you call me when you're in Singapore. You'll be in Singapore how long? There's a layover. Two and a half hours, yeah? Ah. Uh, huh? Yeah, two and a half hours is a layover. Yeah. 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 So when you get to Singapore, when you have VC, you call me. Right. Okay. <coughs> and what if you don't pick up, Mama? Huh? What if you don't pick up? I will pick up in the next hour or whatever. You'll be at the airport. Such a shrub and we'll sit over there where you got internet. Dobro. Playing with your mobile. Dobro. Right. You'll, you have VC over there. Yeah. That, that that's that that's if you do want, I'll call you anyway over there in Singapore. But don't call me directly from your Australia number. No, I won't. I won't. You know how much money he's gonna wait for you to, to pay for? Because <laughs> they yep out like fish. Make sure you switch off mobile when you leave Australia, Daddy. Yeah. Yeah? You have to switch it off, even on the plane, it takes four or five times more from you. What, what to, to receive a call? To receive or to take, you're not allowed to have it on on the, on the plane. Uh, nobody's I was ever... told that when I was leaving uh, Frankfurt Airport, they told me to switch it off because the Breja takes more when you're on the plane. Yeah. I'll see more as you know, where you go on... Uh, on the on regulars where you look through your VFI and that you have to switch off mobile off. Mum, I'll when just take out, I'll, I'll take out the SIM card and that's it. Yeah, Yeah. <clears throat> but you got under, you know, where you got VFI, you've got um, roaming, all that. You just switch all that off and it won't work. Yeah. Yeah. That's what I do when I go with my phone to Bosnia Herzegovina. I just switch it off. Otherwise, I can, you know, how much internet it takes me like fifteen euros a minute. I can help them. Yeah, yeah. Right. Yeah. Right. That's not good. That's not. Just, just take a, take your card out. Yeah, I'll like, take your card out. Put it somewhere safe in your wallet so you have when you come back. Yeah, I'll get a new number when I come back. It's all right. Why are you not messing with me?
Because I, I get discounts on internet. Um, do you pay for that monthly or weekly or is that just a top up? No? Mo monthly. I pay for the first three months, I, I pay $30 and then I change my SIM card. Oh, okay. <coughs> I have a new number every three months. Because over there, I get for 15 bucks, I get 40 gigabytes. But then after three months, you pay $30 and you get 10, 10 gigabytes. Uh -oh. You see, the banks are trying to rip you off. Yeah. I've got quite two sets, I think. Now it's 1.31 in the morning. Coco. 1.31 in the morning. What did you eat today, Mama? Mishka. <coughs> Govna. <laughs> I didn't eat anything today. But tonight I'm going to have um, some salad with... Um, I have some corn with ladle. I told the cheese catch some steak. Uh, I'll pass me still a bit to the wall. Yeah, yeah. I'm not even hungry. I came home not long ago, I had to wait three hours. It's a good day. He told us at 3.30, and it was like 12.30 when we came, so we went for a drive down the lake on Aqua Crescenta. I had an ice cream. Uh -huh. I had a coffee, and then by the time we drove over there and came back, it was time. You know? And then we <coughs> waited 40 minutes for him to... Take out the tires, power their fail again, put them on the other tires, and then uh -huh. put each tire in a bag, and then put it in my back seat. Yeah, yeah. And I just put it in the garage. Yeah. Fair enough. They can keep it for you, like for for winter. Ah. Uh -huh. You don't even have to take it, but. <clears throat> It's like 60 euros. I would have paid it, like, you know, but yeah. a lot of Germans do that because they don't have garages, they live in flats, they don't have room for the tires, so they yeah. pay yeah. 50, 60 dollars and they put them under some code and then when you come back and to change your home, yeah. they, they're there, Did you, you know, do it? which is good. Yeah. No, I've got a garage, Danny. I'm not giving him the. It's enough, 600 almost. I gave euros for tires, your shit tour, the night. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they're all nicely, every, every gourmet is in their bag. Uh huh. They wrap it up in a bag, each tire. Yeah. And then I just put it in the garage, and then when it comes uh, winter, I go and change them. So it did all fit in the car? Did the tyres fit in the car? Back seat, all full. Ah. Yeah. <coughs> That's good I that guess I've got some stuff in the car, rubbish, tub of lava, you can't fit it all, all full yeah. in the back seat, uh, in the coffin. Uh -huh. It's easier in the back seat, and that's it. Uh. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Lucky they put they, they wrapped her with a bag, because otherwise... And they have to, Daddy. Mm. They have to. That's the way it is, yeah. <clears throat> because otherwise yeah, it makes... Imagine giving 600 euros and then just throwing the fucking gummy in the car like that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's more presentable. Yeah, it's, that's the way it is. Yeah. They have to do that. Yeah. yeah. Usually Paul, it's a tub or maybe through dog shit and all that. You sent me a while to study. Yeah. Uh, hey, Mum, I have to go office works as well. What? You know what office works is? No. It's a printing company. For what, Daddy? To print my police check. Ah. Uh, you need a photocopy. Yeah, because I have it by email. I have the, I have it by email, but I have to go over there and. Put it on my USB so I can go and print it out so I have the paper. Okay, but <coughs> leave that uh, email. Don't delete it so you can have it just in case. Yeah, I have it. Don't worry. It's on my computer. Yeah. So did your dad go to meet us? 
I don't know. I slept. He, he didn't go anywhere. Wait, you wake up? He didn't go what? anywhere. He didn't go anywhere. Yeah. Did he talk to you about anything? Did he say you'll eat there? Stand up and No, he said like, does he want to wake me up for poker? I said nah. How do you don't want to go to poker no more? Nah. <laughs> Saving your money, huh? Yeah. Okay, <clears throat> okay then you're small like you're here, see Yeah, just a bit of time. Are you happy? Yeah, I'm happy. I'm happy to travel a bit. Uh, it's, been, it's been a while. Oh, fuck. Can't put your bit there, he can't see it there now, he's young. Call businessman. <laughs> <laughs> He sat on his seat and there was a girl, you know, sitting, she sat next to him. Uh -huh. And her friend was on another seat, I don't know. They couldn't change seats. They got that seat number and that's it. Yeah. <clears throat> and then two Bosnia girls, they went for a weekend to Paris. Yeah. Yeah. He told my new douche or with his fucking preach and uh, try to teach them, oh, Paris is like this. You have to watch out. There's pick up pockets. I can imagine Tom a two and a half hour flight. You know? <laughs> <laughs> Tom goes. They were back on the same flight when he was going back to Mostar, Zash. Yeah, oh. She ran away from him. <laughs> <laughs> she goes, turned her head around. I go, probably fucking Udushi or CM with her for your talks, fucking two hours, eh? <laughs> She didn't run away, she just turned her head like pretending she didn't see him. <laughs> I can't imagine if the poor thing got the same seat like you again. <laughs> she fucking didn't stop talking, eh? Yeah. She probably got bored fucking well, man. <laughs> She was maybe young, 18, 19, yeah, boy, 61, fucking years old. There's a new dad of work at the end. Very funny, eh? Uh, yeah. So I have a few things to do before I come, Mama. Yeah, good. You got your police record? Yeah. Yeah, we see. I'm surprised I did it on my own <laughs> without Tatamira's help. I've <coughs> uh, never done it. I've never yeah, done it before. Before you, did, before you did drugs and all this, you used to go to work on your own. You used to earn money <coughs> on your own. Yeah. You used to put everything. What's wrong with you? Yeah. Here, saying, you know English and you can talk. So. Yeah, but I'm saying, I'm saying because I've never done a police check on my own before. Yeah, yeah. Was easy. Hey, mom, do you know how scary it was when I was traveling around Australia or by myself? Yeah. Hey, mom, I want to ask you for Frankfurt. I mean, for Berlin. Is there a chance we can go together or? Don't ask me questions that I don't know. When? Yeah, yeah. Hey mum, because uh, I see I've seen over there there's some hostels over there, it's like forty bucks a night. And it's I can go by so I can go by myself over there by train. He my friend, he my friend Tamo. But I miss us on the Buddha Sam because, like, I like to be alone. Yeah, that's not. But then we will see what you're gonna do. Okay. Yeah. You want to see with your brother? Yeah, but yeah. You want to be with you? Yeah, I want to be with you. It's all right. 
I'd rather be with you, Mama. You're, you're, you're sad all the time already, you see that? Yeah. Yeah. You're already alone. Every day you're alone. Yeah, but I'd rather, I'd rather be with you anyway. It's alright. Uh, yeah. <coughs> Are you eating it? It's cold, it comes like that. Uh -huh. The fridge, it just, it's not, no breadcrumbs or anything, just uh -huh. the fillet in fast. Yeah. Because I was cold fasting for 16 hours. Uh huh. Oh. Hey, Mama, I recently went to Seven Link and I didn't want to wait over there. Yeah, there was a lot of people, and it would have taken me three hours to get even the appointment over there. So I'm gonna go. Yeah. I'm gonna go before before it closes, because there's less people. When when does it close? Well, it closes around four thirty, four o'clock. Ashtabla, Ashtabla? I have to. I have to go over there to tell them to put the that medical certificate so that the employment provider can see it. Aha. Yeah. Well, it's not showing up on. That. It's not showing up on the computer. Yeah. <clears throat> and I had to go to toilet. You I was do like, that before you go. Yeah, I was sitting down. I was sitting down. I had to go to toilet. And then, like, by the time they call me, I would piss myself. Yeah. You do this this week, go. Yeah, I'll go this week. I'll go. I have to go on the thirty first of May. I have an appointment with them. But what I'm gonna do first is I'm gonna call them. I'm gonna call them to see if it's showing on their computer. And if not, then I'll just go send a link. Because maybe maybe somehow it's showing on their computer somehow. Because like that that lady wrote the message about what's happened with me in their computer, and then they told me to sit down to get the appointment, and then may, maybe because I left, that woman went and wrote it down into the computer. So maybe we'll see. Oh yeah, okay. Talk, Kobe, yeah. You'll be alright. Yeah. <laughs> that's that's most important for you to do. Yeah. Sure. Uh huh. Yeah. I have time. Don't you do that because you got this week, you got next week, and the week after that Friday you leave. Huh? Yeah. It's a Friday when you leave. Yeah. So I have this week, I have next week, next week next week and the week after I leave. So this week, next week and then the week after I leave. Hey no I mean mum, I, I asked I asked Branka Charapinya to come see us when I when I when we come over there to Moscow. Oh, uh, she's married, Bogatier. Yeah, but that's all right. Like she can come over. That's why her fucking uh, her brother's calling me, Daddy. He uh, he thinks that I can bring him to Germany or something. I can help me. Ah. Uh. Uh. I can't bring people here to Germany. I can't find myself work. I don't look in Yeah. 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 I didn't. I just yeah. asked her to come for. Only some of them are in any interest. You know what I mean? They're all looking for interest. These people. Yeah. They think, yeah, I'm in Germany. I can bring them here. That's all. All the only they had that PA said it. Java. I don't know. I can't report so. Yeah. Yeah. I didn't know that. So what, should I call her or not? 
Pa vidit ćemo da li, ali ja nju ne mogu da idem njoj, pa njoj donositi njenoj djeci i davati tamo. Ja. Briga me za njih. Ja, I'm saying, I'm saying... Ti ako hoćeš da odeš, da vidiš odeš tamo, she's in Ljubuški, I think, somewhere or something. Ja. Ali mene ne interesi, od mene neće i dobi ništa. I'm, I'm not close to them, I don't care. I was there, ali postao briga me, pa kad znači. I'm saying, I'm saying for her to come over our house. Ona je na mater, she didn't even come to Baka, Baka died, she didn't come to the funeral. Okay? Either did her mother. And yeah. she lives in Mostar. Yeah, uh, yeah. Musti. No. <coughs> Don't say nothing, it got to go. Yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, I woke up at 11 o'clock. I went, I went to bed at 4. I'm telling you, slowly you're going to have to get back to the rhythm of waking up earlier than you. Yeah. Uh, you're going to fuck up. You, you know, most of all, yeah, that you ring me up when you're at your doctor's. That we are casual. What? What are you going to say? He has to tell you what time to take your medication because of the time zone. It's all different, Danny. Uh, it's very important. I'm going to ask him myself, Mama. It's all right. Yeah, but you have to do that, Danny. Yeah, I will. Uh, uh. <clears throat> Never pick medication when you feel like it. Yeah. Uh. yeah. You know that when you come back to Australia, they're going to take a blood test. And yeah. then you're in deep shit. They'll take off your payment, everything. Yeah, yeah. Uh. So you tell your doctor, you give him that itinerary, the, of the, that, that I'm sure you're going to get a, a normal look at now, before, because uh, all, all right, many posts, like when, when, when it's closer, a few days, you're yeah. going to have a normal card that you can show them. Which, which card? Which card? For what? Boy, for Putovania. Uh-huh. Yeah. Passport, you mean? Then your ticket. Oh. Yeah, you have a proper booklet. He's gonna send me, but it's a, the check-in is not open. Check-in opens three days before your flight. Uh huh. <coughs> so yeah. you'll get that ticket when three days before your flight. Then I'll send it to you. Yeah, but a they're gonna ticket. they're gonna give me that ticket over there. I know, Daddy, but you still have to show them. Maybe it will be a code or something. I don't know. Yeah, no. yeah, dobro. Yeah. Yeah, but before, Mama, I just put my name in the in the system and they find it. Yeah, yeah. 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 Oh. It didn't near my look what they eat them table for some reason. I didn't have a Will. wish to go over there. Uh-huh. Uh huh. 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 You should watch the movie The Berlin Wall. When they closed the wall and all the Germans got stuck on the other side, they were very poor. Oh. For 30 years, parents, children were, 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 um, were separated. Uh -huh. And then good. after 30 years, in 1992, I think, they opened the wall, and then parents saw their children for the first time and all that. Well, there's a Berlin Wall over there, is there? But that was under Russia or something. I don't know. You have to go look at the Berlin <clears throat> Wall. Go and look at the documentary. You'll find out. Yeah, yeah. yeah. They were very, very poor over there. So, so do you know why the war started over there? Or? It wasn't a war, Danny. They just closed it with fucking gates and everything. And people couldn't get out. It was under Russia. Uh -huh. It wasn't a war. It was just under Russia. Uh -huh. Yeah. yeah. That's how you have to tell me, explain. You have to go and watch it. Yeah, yeah. Go and watch the documentary of the Berlin Wall. Okay. <coughs> Places where you like to go, you should find out some things about it. Yeah. Yeah.
Yeah. Yeah, well, if you had that down, down there, well, I for them to see the... Uh, is there Amsterdam? Yeah. Uh, the Anna story, the Jews, they got stuck and were killed later. They were in the attic for a few years. Oh. And they were hiding and... Uh, what's her name? Anna Frank. Anna Frank. Ah, oh, Anna Frank. And there's a museum there. Uh, they got stuck in the attic there, and then the, the, they all got to go to law, got him, and they killed them there. Some of them died from hunger, and uh, wow. one day maybe I'd like to go over there. I'd like to see the museum over there. I think where the museum is, that's where that attic was. Uh -huh. you know? So you should always well learn about the place where you're going. Yeah, um, yeah. So that you know what you're looking for over there. Yeah, yeah. Many near interesting going and looking at big buildings. I've got, I had that in Australia. I don't need that. Yeah. I like to see things that I read about and I like to go and see that, you know. Uh -huh. Not just bang, you know, and looking at fucking 50-story uh, buildings. Talk about it interesting. In fact, I got that in York Street in Australia in fucking... <laughs> Everywhere, uh, that I, doesn't interest I, me. I, I like to see it all, Mama. I like to see the, the the buildings and the scenery. I like to see also museums. I don't like museums that much. Only what interests me. But um, I don't like seeing museums with pictures and that. But I'm not interested. But things like that, you know, museums where Anna Frank was and all this bullshit. I can't yeah, get yeah. Only all my <clears throat> many buildings don't interest. I was brought brought up in a big grad Sydney. Yeah. I lived in Newtown until I was ten years old. I know about fucking the whole Sydney there. Yeah. Uh, many thought they interest in those big gigantic. Ali Owako, the premier uh, scenery, old things, you know, like that you didn't see in Australia, like. Old town, like you got in Dubrovnik, the old town. That is the most tourist place, is the old town. Yeah, yeah. Uh, that's where the tourists go. That's where they want to see the old town, the cupboard that's 5,000 years old and all that. You know? But yeah. I wrote the other day, they fucking put coffee is six euros over there now in Dubrovnik. <laughs> oh, wow. That's yeah, why. Dubrovnik like is pretty expensive unless you go well, out where normally you would be the people that live there. They don't go to the old town to have a coffee. Yeah. Ali Bicha Morti, she had no other poppy ever at the table, the prosciutto, but the Vidish and Cassie, you can go to the rest of the ground on a quaco, but it's not that interesting. Yeah. I just like to walk it. I like uh, to walk it. I record, uh, maybe because Sarajevo City, there's no parking over there. It's fucked. Uh -huh. Maybe I'd track you and him on the train to go to Sarajevo. Okay. It's about 20 euros for each person there and back. Yeah. But going by train, they say, is one of the world's nicest trips. Is Mostar Sarajevo. Because you're going through tunnels. You're going... Oh. Across Nere Club, you know? Wow. And Toffa goes, I want to go by train, I want to go by train. <laughs> <laughs> has has Toma hey, been to Sarajevo? No, I don't think walking like I did before. In that, but oh. um, I'll see how I feel. If I don't feel good, I'm going to say, I'll just put you two on the fucking train station and choose. <clears throat> it's better but you come there's only us. two trains. There's one in the morning at 6.45, I think. And mm. it comes back at five something from Sarajevo. So uh -huh. I think it takes an hour to get there. So I think seven, eight hours walking around Sarajevo and the old town and all that is enough for you. Too. Yeah, yeah. For one day, huh? For one day, Shtabiti then. Yeah, that's plenty, Mama. Plenty. There's nothing else to see in Sarajevo. Sarajevo is big, but it's all fucking buildings, old buildings, people, poor people, Tsigani fucking asking for money on the street. <laughs> Yeah. The Audrey Dash Wall Town, that's it. That's where the tourists go. Yeah, yeah. They have a Nikta Drugo Day Dash. Yeah. Yeah. It's like going to Cabramara, Daddy. I can help you. They have a 
šta da vidiš. A. Ideš u bar čašnju, pojedeš čevape, osrti lajdari ga kako hoćete i vratite se kući. Ja. The ja. highlight will probably be the train trip. Ja. Yeah. Because it goes through tunnels. Okay. Then you goes out on Deretwa, you see Deretwa everywhere, you think you're gonna fall in fucking Deretwa from the train. <laughs> well, two, two trains did fall into an Deretwa, <clears throat> they don't laugh. Yeah. <laughs> Wow. One, one derailed, but that was ages ago, about 20-something years ago. Yeah. Know? And I don't know what happened to the other one. <laughs> now, at least see, you're going to have to wake up early. So that's yeah. why I said try to get into a rhythm of getting up a bit earlier. Yeah, Gosh. yeah. Može. Yeah. Otherwise, the train's going to leave without you. Yeah. It's 20 bucks each way. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Have you been in the train to Sarajevo? Uh, I've been on the train when I was a kid. I don't want to go on the train. Dear Street in Sarajevo, Toba too. I can. I. I'll clean the house for a day or two in the Okay, Vaji. You did yap to him, but he can yap back to you. Yeah. <laughs> You'll have fun with him, Bogatti. Yeah, 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 yeah. Dobro. You know how Toma is. Yeah. Such a bo, such a bo. You're smaller, baby, you're smaller. Just a bit more. And I'm sure I should have got poker on Thursday. If you feel like going, go. Yeah. Isn't it a holiday on Thursday in Australia? I don't know. Yeah, it is. In Germany, it's uh, 40 days after Jesus rose. When they crucified him, yeah? Uh-huh. He stayed, when he rose from the dead, he stayed on earth for 40 days. And on tomorrow is on the 26th, which is a Thursday. Uh, 40 days after Jesus uh, came alive from being dead, yeah, he left. He left Earth 40 days. He was on Earth for another 40 days when he resurrected. Uh-huh. Uh huh. Wow. So on Thursday, it's a day they celebrate God going, uh, Jesus going to heaven. Uh huh. Wow. Because after Jesus resurrected. <laughs> He stayed on earth for 40 days, and after 40 days, he went to heaven. <clears throat> ah. Why did he stay on earth? To teach his apostles ah. what to spread and how to spread the, the word of God. Wow. And he went and sat on the right hand side of his father. Uh huh. Uh, You yeah. know that Jesus sits on the right hand side of the fa- of his father. Yeah, yeah. In heaven. Yeah. Uh, and he will come back to what? Judge the dead and the living. Yeah, yeah. I think it's high time that he comes, Bogami. Uh, yeah. Because too many demons are fucking ruling the world now and fucking people up. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> yeah. Ki tako se ništa ove dane i ti tamo gdje trebaš da završiš to. Don't wait till the last minute. No, I won't. I won't. I'll do it. It's all right. Just a few things to do and that's it. I have a lot of things to do, mom, before I come. <laughs> I remember when I was... Yeah. I had I I had to get my passport. I remember that. I had to get a new passport. And and and, and mum and mum, it was a mum. Do you know it was a blessing when they stole my stuff in Cairns? Why was it a blessing? Because now I never need I I never need Apple products for myself. Do you know Apple? Yeah. Yeah. I, I no longer get myself Apple products, 
and I wouldn't have yeah. the laptop I have today. I wouldn't have the phones I have today. I also, I also wouldn't be able to go to Brisbane before because I had a Queensland passport. And in terms of having a Queensland license, because before it was the coronavirus period, and everyone was closed up in their own states, but I was able to travel back to Queensland because I had a Queensland license. Huh? Yeah, what happened? Ah, uh, this um, my next door neighbour, uh, next door neighbour, the people that live above me. Uh huh. What do they want? But they bought those sticks for the tomatoes, you know. Uh -huh. She goes, "You want me to put it on now?" I go, "You don't have to tomato." Ah, uh, ah, uh, okay. <laughs> Mama well. said that they were too small because the tomatoes grow too big. But it doesn't matter if if they if they're big. If they're too small, Tomo will just cut another piece off and just tie it up so that the tomato... Because okay. last year the tomato was much bigger yeah, than what yeah. those sticks are. How yeah. is it going to hold it? For yeah, yeah. Hey, Mom, I was saying, I was saying that, that the when they stole my stuff, it was a blessing because when the coronavirus came, the coronavirus period, what happened was Sydney was on lockdown and Sydney was not able to travel anywhere. Around Australia, so I had a Queensland, I had a Queensland license, because back in Cairns I had to get myself a Queensland license to travel around Australia, because I, I they stole my license, and then I was able to travel to Queensland because I have a Queensland license and I had an address over there, and that's why I was able to cross borders, from from Sydney to Brisbane. Sorry, <laughs> right, Danny, but you could have got in trouble too. <clears throat> yeah. So that was just Kotska, yeah. yeah. But it wasn't Kotska, yeah, but it was just travelling. Nah. Well, if you've done enough travelling from Australia, then you've yeah, <laughs> not done. You can go to Kangaroo Valley and then see. Kangaroo yeah. Island, Kangaroo Island. Island, yeah. Have you been to Kangaroo Island? No, Danny. Uh -huh. See there. Where, where have yeah, you, Mum? Mum, where have you been around Australia? Melbourne, Queensland, Gulf Coast. Uh huh. That's it. Ah. But then I didn't say well over there, but I could then. I was more on the road. Yeah. I didn't have time to run around. Yeah, yeah. Uh, what we would did... pay the rent and buy you clothes and do and everything. Yeah. Hey, Mum, what did? And uh, my job. Yeah, the moment I eat, then I get out. Yeah. 
I, I'm not no working kid holidays like that. Yeah. You just pick up a go when you feel like it. <laughs> hey, mum, what did you enjoy about Melbourne? Nothing. Uh, Melbourne at that time when I went to Melbourne had fucking four, four seasons. Uh, yeah. In the morning it rains, in the afternoon you fucking, you're just taking your jacket off, with <laughs> shorts on, fucking <laughs> fucked. I don't know about now, but it had four seasons and then it rains from nowhere. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Everybody buying umbrellas from at once. <laughs> That's what I remember from uh, from Melbourne. that. From Melbourne, how about Queensland? A summer each swimming and all that. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. I went as a child too. We did that once somewhere. I don't know. I forgot. Uh huh. I think it took us to Lighting Ridge once, and um, uh-huh. the tragedy was lot. Uh-huh. But we didn't find nothing. Uh-huh. Fair enough. But over there, people live over there. They make at least a, a living over, over there. They always, people like, we only went for a day or two, but there are people living over there, and every day see you is one day. And they say they earn every day $60, $70 and five gold. Oh, wow. You know, like $60, $70 is okay. Yeah, yeah. If you if you do that five days a week, that's three hundred dollars. Yeah. Okay. You know, and I don't fucking know where that gold comes from. There's you know how many people. There was one in Croatia, and he found a nugget over there, two point five million dollars. Eh? Wow. And fucking, it's been there for centuries, and people are still finding gold over there. Wow. That's where you should go and fucking dig. Eh? <laughs> yeah. A lot of people go over there. Yeah, see, mum, you're gonna eat. You're gonna eat fish. You're gonna eat fish tonight. No, I'm gonna make myself some salad with prawns. Uh, Tom, I'll make him a steak or something. Uh Okay. Yeah, I'll two T-bone steaks for you and Tom. Yeah. They're half a kilo each. Oh. And they're very expensive. They're usually about this. They were 21 euros for one. Wow. And I got them for nine euros each. I bought two. Wow. I said, I want it for you and daddy. And I'm, <laughs> I'm not buying it anymore. Yeah. <laughs> That's one each. Oh, He's looking at it. But, you know, 19 euros. 18 euros 50 or something for one. Yeah. Uh, are they expensive in Australia? They're probably up to them. Well, at the restaurant, it's like 40 bucks for a T-bone steak. Uh, <clears throat> yeah. We'll make it on the grill. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Uh, Are you tired, Mama? Yeah, I'm, I'm tired from waiting for those fucking tires. Oh. <laughs> and it was sunny, and we didn't have anywhere to sit, but on the sun, and I hate the sun too much. Yeah. No, bro. I had a tea on that tree and my sesutra, it's a choice. All right, Mama, I'll call you tomorrow, I'd. Right. I, I, I love, love you, them. I love you, ciao. I love you, ciao, ciao, ciao. ciao. ciao.